ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Micro Universe and WWE 2K22. This is episode 3, and we are once again going to be joined by the Flame Sword Dante Inferno, but not just any Dante Inferno, an Inferno that is heading into his first ever United States Championship match in the main event of Raw. It does not get any bigger than this. touched on it a moment ago but when it comes to the history between Bobby Lashley and Dante Inferno Dante Inferno has never beaten Bobby Lashley when the championship was on the line and that is perhaps the most key stat going into this one and that is one key statistic my god that MVP and Bobby Lashley will not soon let Inferno forget but Inferno with the chance of a lifetime here tonight to make that statistic a damn lie and win himself a US championship here tonight but of course Bobby Lashley one of the most dominant champions of this era is not going to allow it to happen at least not very easily, I'll tell you that for damn free. And to play devil's advocate, to be fair to Bobby Lashley, while Inferno has changed a lot since last time these two men were fighting for a championship, so has Bobby Lashley. He has become more dominant than ever before here on Monday night. And you want an example of this man's dominance? Look no further than last week on Monday Night Raw, when he took on Dominic Mysterio and destroyed Mysterio with all due respect. And then after the match, was an entirely different issue when Phoenix Nitro cracked his dome. But I'm sure Lashley is not focused on Phoenix Nitro, Brandon Collins or Aaron Matthews right now, any of Vibe, he is focused on Dante Inferno, dead set on retaining that belt right here tonight. The time for talk is over gentlemen, that right there is what this one is all about. Look at that early going right there, the spine buster, I was about to say the collar and elbow tie up in the early going, Bobby Lashley turning it into a spine buster and now going straight after the knees, we know Inferno doesn't have the greatest knees in the world, but he certainly does have a great striking ability and there's the heartbreak influence influenced by a man who had a great uh, impact on his career no pun intended there but Shawn Michaels of course you know is going to be watching this incredible edition of Monday Night Raw watching Inferno who just got the call up from NXT already in a United States Championship match but it's against the almighty Bobby Lashley and anyone that is a clustering from Bobby Lashley ain't about to have the greatest of times but with that being said if anyone can beat him it's Inferno my god look at the look at the distance he got on that elbow drop right there you want to talk about the influence of Shawn Michaels a, a great man when it came to elbow drops in this business. But as I was about to say, if anyone can get it done against last year, it's Inferno. He did it two weeks ago on Monday Night Raw when he made his Raw debut in that uh, match against Lashley. It's the reason he's getting this championship match now because he scored the upset on Lashley after that uh, brutal Inferno overdrive, the first one of the Monday Night Raw era. This Monday Night Raw crowd certainly not a fan of MVP's shenanigans here on the red brand, but it has helped uh, Bobby Lashley in the Hurt business tremendously since they teamed up. And now Bobby Lashley with that gut buster right right there as Raw rolls on and we want to remind you that this edition of Monday Night Raw this episode of the Micro Universe oh hang on a second a spear by Bobby Lashley this one might be over before it even got underway oh, look at this the kip up by Dante Inferno one with the resilience and now Bobby Lashley striking back with the form of his own back and forth we go between these two men look at this and now Bobby Lashley aka Bobby Nasty look he's about to deliver a Bobby Nasty suplex look at this just toying with Inferno here and dropping him like a stack of of dime. This one might be over already. Look at this. The Hurt Lock. The Hurt Lock is locked in on Dante Inferno. He's put up a hell of a fight, but when it comes to the dominance of Bobby Lashley, there is simply no stopping Bobby in this Hurt Lock right here. Has he got it locked in? No. Inferno managing to disconnect the arms. He, got, he just about gets it, and he gets out of it. Incredible there from Dante Inferno. And now bouncing off the ropes, Inferno went for something, but Bobby Lashley caught him again. And Lashley now going into the cover, but no, a kick out by Dante. Oh god, this has been, oh my god, look at the strength of Bobby Lashley. There is no love loss between these two. And look at that counter from Inferno. Incredible counter there from the Flame Sword. And Inferno is feeling it here. He knows there is only one chance to make a great first impression. One chance to win the US title here tonight. And he's going to take advantage of that, but he gets dropped by Lashley again. Oh, wait a second. Look at this now. Bobby Lashley with the Dominator to Dante Inferno. Hell of a performance from the kid, but it's all over now. No, 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 it is not. A kick out at two and three quarters. Conjoined twins close there from Dante Inferno. He is still alive in this one. But how? You've got to ask yourself how. Is Inferno still going? The fire of a champion. The heart of a warrior from Dante Inferno and the kip up as well. Although with that being said, Inferno put up a hell of a fight. But look at that cut on the head of Dante Inferno. It is only getting worse as this match continues. But Inferno doesn't get it down. He loves the side of blood. I'll never forget the war he had with Walter back 
in NXT. He doesn't give a damn about your distractions anymore, MVP. Inferno is firing on all cylinders, no pun intended now. But lastly, look at the speed of this kid. And by kid, I mean extremely experienced veteran in this business. And like, oh, oh, oh my god, caught him with the knee, caught him with the knee off the back of that spear. And Inferno again off the top. Oh, the axe handle. This crowd is loving it here, and so is Dante Inferno, the flame sword, a part of the Monday Night Raw roster, looking to become champion again, just as he did multiple times in NXT. And now, oh, again, another counter there by Bobby Lashley, another counter by Dante Inferno, as the Irish rips Lashley into the corner right here. What the hell is Inferno thinking here? Live on Monday Night Raw, Spanish fly! Spanish fly from Dante Inferno. Oh my God, but Lashley again. These two men hate each other so damn much. They are fueled on adrenaline alone. This is turning into an absolute all-out war here. Something Inferno is very familiar with from his time in NXT against the likes of Adam Cole and Walter and Tommaso Ciampa, just to name a few. But now Lashley is about to go for a ride, but no, Inferno doesn't connect with it. Lashley getting out of the way. Getting out of the way, excuse me. And Lashley again. Gorilla press. Good boss. And now these two men continue to ball back and fourth Inferno couldn't believe it and neither could the WWE Universe that Bobby Lashley just kicked out of that brutal Inferno overdrive but nevertheless this championship match continues here live on Monday Night Raw big drop kick from the Flame Sword. and we want to remind you that this exciting edition of the Micro Universe is sponsored by the subscribe button click that subscribe button turn on the bell so you don't miss any up and coming episodes of the career of Dante Inferno oh, oh my god these two men are a bit of a deadlock right there went for a spear went for a close line didn't quite connect and now Dante Inferno went for a springboard, got caught by Lashley. Lashley going for the Dominator. Cork screw right there, the Dragon Leg screw. He's getting down into the nitty gritty in this matchup right now. Inferno hip toss. And now Dante Inferno got his head taken off right there by Bobby Lashley. And MVP is loving every single second of that dominance. Lashley, oh wait, he was back in control for a second there. Drop kick right there. A little precise drop kick from Dante Inferno taking down Bobby Lashley. Inferno with with the heart of a warrior and the fire of a champion, a former NXT North American champion, a former NXT champion as well, but Lashley again. Bobby Lashley again. Look at this, always finding time to glow, and why shouldn't he? He's the almighty United States champion. Look at this, that's personal. Just stomping on Dante Inferno's damn chest, but Inferno, look at this. The flurry of strikes again, taking down Lashley. Inferno needs to capitalize on this situation right here. Can he do so with a straight? Jacket, DDT, busting him wide open. Oh, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, Dante Inferno is about to win his first championship on Monday Night Raw. No, Lashley again with another counter. Lashley with a counter to the Inferno Overdrive Dominator. How quickly the tide can turn in a championship match when he was dominant as the Dominator. And now Lashley again, Dominator to Dante Inferno. Bobby Lashley. Retains the championship. It's a tale about his oldest time when a title is on the line. Lashley beats Inferno. <laughs> Inferno could never beat me when the title was on the line. I told you. I told you. I told you what. Brutal simply but a knee by Aaron Matthews. Vibe are here. Hey, no, no, no. Stop. 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 Nah, I, I never needed or wanted your help. This has nothing to do with you. Who the hell do you think you are? We targeted you because one, we don't respect Lashley as a champion and well for you Inferno, you interest us, you interest me. We watched you all throughout NXT and so I'm sure even you are smart enough to know where I'm going with this. But it's a one time offer bud, you're either with us or you're going to live to regret it. Now you take as long as you want to make that decision but once the decision has been made there ain't no going back. And as for everyone else, you've just been put on notice so consider this your final warning. Anyone that crosses us from now on is going to feel the vibe.